Hey everybody, this is John Morris. We're going to do a quick run through of how to upgrade the main PCB in your applesauce. Um, here we got a early applesauce and the replacement board here. First off, we are just going to flip it over. We got two screws that we need to undo down here. Okay, our two screws will come out. Now we need to just open the case. Um, there's a little bit of sticky tape inside that holds the rear board firm. So we just need to pull a little bit. You can see it's fighting back here. It's some mounting tape. Um, or just wiggle it. Okay. Once we have it opened up here, you just open it up a little bit because we got the USB cable connected here. So we can just pop the cable off here and scoot the lid to the side. So this is what we have now. And here there are three screws that need to be removed. So we'll just pull those three out real quick. Okay, once those three screws are out, we can kind of lift by the front and we can pull the entire thing off. The front and rear panels just kind of sit in place. Now we have these risers here that provide the lights and stuff. These will just lift straight up. They're, they're all pins, so just lift them up and we're down to the main board. So what we need to do is we now need to take the teensy off of here. And this you want to kind of reach underneath on both sides and gently lift it up as evenly as possible. And so we have this removed now, okay? Now all we need to do is get our new board out. We will line up the feet on the teensy, making sure that the USB connector is facing towards the back here. And when all the pins look like they are lined up well, we're just going to apply some even pressure and seat the whole thing. Okay. Now we can get our riser boards and plug them in. Make sure that they're seated all the way down. There's a little tab here to make sure that it stays, it comes through the slot here to, to keep that firm. And our board is ready. So we have our board ready here. So now we need to get our front and rear panels and feed them through and these will sit into the slots in the case and drop back in. At this point we can put our three screws back in. I tend to put to start all three screws and then tighten them down after just to make sure that everything is aligned properly. Okay, so our board is in. Want to make sure everything's pushed down, that all the everything looks like it's good and tight. Our face is up. All of our holes are properly lined up. And then we will get our USB cable and our top lid, and we will plug that into the TNC. And then we slide the cable into the little hole here. 
and put the top back on. Okay, and remember to press down at the rear here, that'll reseat the tape to keep that keeps the rear board rigid. And then we drop our screws back in. And that's it. We have upgraded this applesauce. Now we're just going to take it over to the applesauce software and plug it in. And it'll do firmware updates. Um, and allow us to run some tests to make sure that everything's working right. So, yep, thanks for watching.